So the same way can, can someone have a spirit that will rather lead the person to destruction, like if good things are coming to the person, then, then he will blow those good things away. Yes. Those are the spiritual police. Those are the mm -hmm. demons that can follow you. If man self proposed to you today, the man will say everything. The man wish that they would just break, maybe go purchase car, give you, or purchase something important, give you. Before they go break, that spirit will change that person in mind. The person will forget, say, now he said, promise you something. Hey. If you are going to look for work, before you read there, the work, they will see you, they will take your CV, everything be okay, they're happy. Uh, tomorrow, come and start work. That day, that spirit will change everything. Before you go read there, the next day, they will tell you oh, the work said, they take you somebody a long time, but they forget to tell ah. you. That's what you did. Ah. So spiritual police is following many people into this world. They are the baddest demons. They are called spiritual police. They disturb people. They disturb so many things. Whatever you work out for, they will destroy it. Many of the people, many of the beings, the mortals can feel that something is following them. Many can have that feeling that even though when they are sleeping, they feel like somebody is lying by them. Somebody is touching them. They have that feelings, but they can't see anybody around them. So if you have those kind of things in your life, uh, you don't run to man of Jesus. Make them carry their prayers alone. This one, you need to do something. A sacrifice needs to be done to appeal that spirit so that that spirit will stop following you for you to have peace of mind, for all your promise to be, will be fulfilled in the physical world, for you to enjoy the world before you die. Good See, yeah, some, some people are asking right now on our life that how do we get rid of the spiritual police? Those spiritual police, only spiritual, only sacrifice. Only sacrifice. They are demons. They are free agents. <laughs> So if you feed your family gods, whatever you say through that sacrifice, now them will suck them from you. That is their work in the spiritual world. But because you are not minding them, them too, they not go mind you. So you go take your head and knock physical world, thinking your prayers can suck them. Your prayers cannot suck them. Only a spirit who lives in the spiritual world can fight for you because you are not there to fight for yourself. You are in the physical world to fight for yourself. You are not in the spiritual world. So sacrifice need to be done for those kind of spiritual police to stop following you. Otherwise, they will destroy your things till you grow old and die. And not only you, they will rule your whole generation. Generation upon generation, they will rule them in their own way. Thank you, Sia. 